Hello. Hey guys, it's Ria. And so in my last update video, I said that I was going to try and make YouTube videos more often. So two videos in a week, I think. That's pretty good. I'm pretty proud of myself. So my new, or not new, but um, my new goal for this YouTube channel is to kind of put together a variety of stuff. So like music and some maybe beauty videos and uh, also some stuff that YouTubers do like challenges, tags, all that good stuff. And to kick off my uh, YouTube YouTuber, you, YouTube, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> to kick off um, the new Rhea channel, YouTube world thing, I thought that I would do the TMI tag. I know I'm a little behind on the TMI tag, but I thought that it would be a fun way for us to get to know each other and yeah, okay, let's get started on this tag. I have all the questions here on my phone. Oh, before I continue, just I want to just show you something. I don't know how you pronounce this dog brand, dog breed, dog brand. A Dachshund? I, I think it's a Dachshund. And it's really cute, and it has like just a little head, and like, it's really cute. Yeah, let's begin. Question number one. What are you wearing? Um, I actually really like this. I got it from H&M. I'll stand up so you can see it. It's just this really cute little black dress with all these white cats on it, and... I'm a huge fan of black clothes and white clothes because it makes my hair pop. I'm a huge cat lover and what kind of sucks is I'm actually allergic to cats so it makes me really sad because I want to adopt a cat so bad but I don't want to like hug it and be like you're so you're so cute you know it's so hard. Question two, have you ever been in love? Well, I've been to McDonald's and Taco Bell, so yes. Um, no, in all seriousness, I think that everyone does at some point in their life. Yeah, sure, let's go, let's go with that. Question number three, have you ever had a terrible breakup? Not really. Question four, ooh, how tall are you? How tall am I? All of my friends are like super tall. They're like 5'7 and up. So I'm like the tiniest. I'm 5'4, but I think that's average. I'm not sure. I'm 5'4 anyways. Question five, how much do you weigh? Okay, so I made this vlog a while ago. I'll like put it in this region here so you can watch it if you want. It was a vlog about how I lost weight and I went from 148 pounds and then I was 118 at that time, but now I am 115 pounds and I've been that weight for a while now, so I think that's like stagnated. Question six, any tattoos? No, I do not have any tattoos. I don't think I plan on getting any tattoos. I think that it would have to mean a lot to me for me to get a tattoo. Question seven, any piercings? I have piercings here on my ears, that's it. I don't actually wear earrings that much. So, but I like the fact that I do have ear, ear piercings so that when I do wanna wear earrings, I can uh, kinda bring them out. I really wanna get um, the cartilage pierced though. Question number eight, OTP, okay. Oh, this is so hard because I ship so many things, okay. Oh, I'd have to say that right now my biggest OTP right now and not just as a couple pairing but as like a general pairing pairing like they're just they're like ooh, they're like a super team from game of thrones jamie lannister and brianna tarth i just i think that they're just like the best team ever and like they're all these scenes and i just hits me right in the feels because they belong together not jamie and cersei let's be real okay oh, they're just they're so beautiful i need a moment hold on okay question nine is what is your favorite show I actually don't watch that much TV. My favorite show would have to be a tie between, like an even tie, a perfectly even tie between Teen Wolf, Game of Thrones, and Drivers, Dive Ins, and Dives because guy though, let's be real, guy though. Question number 10, favorite bands. Okay, um, it would have to be again another tie kinda between Fall Out Boy, Paramore, The 1975, and Maroon 5. Yeah, that would be it. Question 11, something you miss. Hmm, something I miss. I'm having like a mass brain fart right now. What is it that I miss? I miss remembering what I miss. So I'm gonna skip that question for now because I honestly. <sighs> question 12, what is your favorite song? Um, There's a lot of favorite songs I have, but if it's one song that I kind of constantly like go back to and it's like my happy place I guess under control by the strokes 
Yeah. Ooh, how old am I? Okay, I am 17 years old. I just turned 17 in July, so that's exciting. July 16, same birthday as Luke Hemmings. It's a sign. Question 14, zodiac sign. I am a cancer, a little crab, Sebastian under the sea cancer, and in the Chinese zodiac, I'm an ox. I'm an ox. Question 15, a quality you look for in a partner. Ooh. I think that when you are looking for someone to date, I think the biggest quality, in my opinion, is honesty. Because if they're honest, everything's going to be on the table. And then I feel like if someone's really honest with you, there's not going to be any problems. So, honesty. Question 16, favorite quote. I'm not sure who actually wrote this quote, but I think that it's very simple, straightforward, and yet really beautiful and inspiring at the same time. It's, um... Never look down on someone unless you are helping them up. Question 17. Favorite actor? Easy peasy. Johnny Depp. Question 18. Favorite color? Anyone who knows me is going to know that it's pink because everything in my room is pink, everything I own is pink, my phone case is pink, my iPod case is pink, my actual iPod itself is pink, I dye my hair pink, everything I own pretty much is pink. <laughs> 19. Loud music or soft? When I'm like alone, kind of, or like if I'm indoors, I like my music soft. But if I am outside, like in the car or anything, I like my music really loud and like... Or if there's a lot of noise around and I just want to be in my own world, then I will turn on loud music and go as loud as I can be, really. 20. Where would you go when you're sad? When I'm sad, I like to be alone, so I would either hide in my room, kind of, or if I'm in public, I'll, like, go to the bathroom or somewhere and just kind of go there for a while and just, like, count to ten, do breathing exercises or whatever until I'm fine and then I can go out. 21. How long does it take you to shower? On days that I wash my hair, it can take anywhere from, like, I don't know, 15 minutes to, like, maybe half an hour or more. I'm not sure, actually, because sometimes I'll just, like, do the washing of the hair and then I'll just, you know, shave or whatever and do my actual bathing stuff. Sometimes I'll exfoliate or I'll do, like, a hair treatment. Other days when I don't wash my hair and it's in, like, a shower cap or whatever, it can take me normally, like, 5 minutes to 10 minutes max. Not really that long. 22. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? If I'm going to school, it normally takes me an hour to an hour and a half because I like to style my hair every day. If I'm filming, it can take me anywhere from two hours to three hours depending on how much makeup I have to put on or how my hair has to be. And if I'm just going out to get something from the store, probably like five minutes, put it in a bun, you know. 23. Ever been in a physical fight? Oh gosh, no, and I hope that I will never be in a physical fight. 24. Turn on. Ooh, I find it really attractive when guys can play instruments, like if it is the guitar or the bass or the piano or the drums, if you can play an instrument, hello, hunty. 25. A turn off. Um, I don't necessarily want to say it turn off because I don't want to offend anybody. <laughs> I think everyone else has different turn offs, assuming that these are turn offs and turn offs for someone that you'd want to date. If you're going to be in a relationship with someone who isn't loyal, it's. Eh. 26. The reason I joined YouTube. Because I love to edit videos, so I would make like Sims videos and like. I don't know, Kingdom Hearts videos, Final Fantasy videos, Panic at the Disco, Fangirl videos. Then eventually I got more into music, so I wanted to start posting my music online, like my originals and covers and all of that, because singing is what I love to do the most. But recently I've really been watching a lot of other YouTubers and beauty gurus and all of that, so I want to kind of injectify. That's not a word, is it? Injectify. I kind of want to inject that into my channel, so... Now that I am kind of rebooting my channel, that's kind of why I want to do it, is because I'm just so inspired by these people and they're just so devoted to their passion and their craft that I want to be like them and inspire others as well. So that's why I started YouTube. 27. Fears. <laughs> I'm 17 and I am like afraid of the dark sometimes and I don't mean like I need to sleep with the night like like no I like to sleep with the lights off and the doors closed and everything but sometimes the dark can be so scary for me like if I'm outside and it's getting dark like I, I'm scared that a bear is gonna like come out of nowhere and like knock me over like I could be in the middle of like downtown Vancouver and I'm gonna think there's gonna be a bear that's gonna like come out of Sephora and like maul my face I don't know that's just me another thing that I'm never going to get over is my fear of bugs. <laughs> like anyone who knows me knows that I'm terrified of bugs. I don't just mean like huge spiders, like I mean like fruit flies. Like, well not maybe not fruit flies, but like flies. There can be a fly buzzing around my house and I will literally hide in the corner and ask someone to smack it because I can't with bugs. It's so bad. It is so bad and embarrassing. <laughs>
Okay, question 28. Nas. What am I saying? The last thing that made you cry. Okay, the last thing that I remember making me cry. Movies, I'd say. I saw The Fault in Our Store. The Fault in Our Stores. The Fault in Our Stores. Our coupons are only 25% off instead of 50. Okay, I saw the movies The Fault in Our Stars and if I stay from the middle of the movie to the end to like 20 minutes after the movie I was like a hot mess I was in the movie theaters with puffy eyes and it was just black all around and it was not cute it was not cute but the movies like that really like hit me in the heart cuz the feels man the feels 29 last time you said you love someone I said I love you to my mom right before I filmed this video 30 meaning behind your YouTube name Rhea Jade music Rhea Jade that's me and I like music Whoa, creativity 31. Last book you read. Last book I read, I actually can't remember because I don't really read. Oh, it's the book. It's the book Game of Thrones, not the, not the TV show. The book you're currently reading. The book I am currently reading is Game of Thrones. I can't really remember the book I read before Game of Thrones, so I'll just use that as my answer. 33. Last show that you watched. I'm catching up on Game of Thrones right now, season four, I'm like halfway done, and then I'll be ready to go. 34, last person you talked to, my mom and my sister, because we're all home, so, you know what's up. 35, the relationship between you and the person you last texted. I'm actually not a huge texter, which is kind of weird, because like, I'm always on my phone, but the reason why I'm always on my phone is because I have like, a really bad addiction with Bubble Shooter and that Kim Kardashian game. I don't actually text that many people. My last text was just a notification from Twitter, so I, I, we have a tweeting relationship. <laughs> 36. Favorite food. I actually don't think I have a favorite food because I like food so much that I enjoy all food. If it could be like a food category, then I would pick Japanese because like you can put me, I can have Japanese food for the rest of my life. Thank you lord for Japanese food. 37. What's a place that you want to visit? I have always wanted to go to California and another place I wanted to visit is the UK. If anyone knows anything about me, it's that I am like an Anglophile and I'm obsessed with all things that are English. 38. The last place you were. I was in the kitchen and I toasted bread and I put this amazing spread on it and it is so good. It's, I don't remember what brand it is, but it's like goat cheese and red bell peppers or something. I don't know. It's, it's beautiful and you need to get on that because... <clears throat> so good. So good. 39. Do you have a crush? Aw, oh, that's cute. It's kind of supposed to be a secret, but I'm having a really hard time picking between Dylan O'Brien and Luke Hemmings because they are both very beautiful. One is brunette, one is blonde. You get the best of both worlds. Am I right? Oh, but don't forget Adam Levine. He's really pretty too. 40. Last time you kissed someone. I kissed my mom on the cheek before I filmed this. 41. Last time you were insulted. I don't think I remember the last time I was insulted in the face. I don't know, I don't really remember any insults directly to me, but hopefully that doesn't happen anytime soon, so. 42. Favorite flavor of sweet. I like any kind of chocolate. Um, dark chocolate is my favorite. I like vanilla stuff. 43. What instruments do you play? I play the piano and the guitar and I sing and if you guys have been watching my YouTube videos for a while, you know that, so... Woohoo! 44. Favorite piece of jewelry. Ooh! And my favorite piece of jewelry would have to be this ring. Okay, it's just this, like, cute little ring with, like, gold and diamond hearts on it. My mom got it. I don't remember where it's from, but she gave it to me when I was 13, and I have never, ever taken it off since. I don't know, I just really like it. 45. Last sport you played. <laughs> me in sports! 46. Last song you sang. Just recently, I recorded my original Aphrodite's Child. I know that a lot of people have been asking about it and like when it can be on iTunes and stuff and that's coming out pretty soon so just keep updated on my social media. 47. Favorite chat up line. One of my favorite pickup lines is, hey I lost my number, could I have yours instead? If it's just a line that you're just using to talk to someone or to start a conversation, I just like going like, I. 48. Have you ever used it? The I one? Yeah, I have. But the pickup line one? No. I'm terrible with using pickup lines. Like, if I see someone who I think is cute, I'm just gonna, like, instead of saying something, I'm just like, I. I have to go now. 49. Last time you hung out with anyone. I'm a really busy person, so I don't really hang out that much, I guess. 
but I think the last time I hung out with someone was Friday or Thursday. I went shopping. That's all I know. 50. Who should answer these questions next? I'm going to tag all of you guys out there to do this TMI tag. I'm going to put the questions down below. I hope that you like this video and I guess get, got to know a little bit more about me. And I want to get to know you guys some more too, so it'd be awesome if you could like that video. All of my new friends that are my uh, future new friends, I'd like to tag you guys. I want to be friends with all of you guys. You know what they say, the uglier the Snapchat, the closer the friendship. And so I'm going to give you some live ugly Snapchats right now so we can all be best friends. Anyways, yeah, I hope you guys like this video. And if you have any requests or anything or challenges, stuff that you'd like me to do, just comment below. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and if you're going to do that tag. Be sure to follow me on social media because I am alive on those websites. And yeah, until then, I will see you guys soon next time. Bye!